Hello everybody, I'm Roberto Morelli, a radio frequency engineer. I come from uh, Italy and I did my bachelor in uh, Politecnico di Torino and then I moved to Germany for uh, into Munich for my master uh, in uh, communication engineer in a uh, technical university Munich. Since November 2020 I joined to Huawei as uh, a radio frequency test and analysis engineer in the service delivery and the network optimization department. To Huawei, Deutsche Telekom, and each one of them has their own network and they want to improve it. And this is the reason why they always ask to vendors like Huawei to improve their uh, the performances. And uh, however, the performance of the network depends on different parameters. They can uh, be parameters affecting the different technologies. So if, for instance, our mobile phone detected 2G, 3G, 4G, or in some regions as well, 5G, or uh, parameters that uh, can affect the speed or as well the failures or our voice quality or um, there are so many that uh, actually they have a deep change in our daily life however based on these parameters we as rf engineer we try to first uh, get uh, the measurement so we go with, with our equipment in, on the field to test to take and to measure the signals and the coverage and then we go to analyze data then propose to the customer itself what we found out our discovery and how actually we can improve it i would say that uh, everything is uh, interesting and challenging because uh, it's not like only one software or uh, that uh, you are going to deal with there are different and each one of them will take certainly time and then uh, uh, patience and as well, but it will be really rewarding because in our job as a engineer, we can see how our job can affect the network. And so you can immediately see how, how you changing or that parameter can really affect uh, our daily life. This is the things that I like the most about my job. Certainly, working as Huawei is a challenging task because uh, anyway, even if uh, uh, it requires a dedication, passion, to be passionate, and certainly rather than being concerned on knowing that or that software, because everything will be learned here, step by step, and thanks to the help of even of our amazing colleagues here. However, the task and the most important thing is to have the will to discover something new and even to deal with maybe different projects at the same time and uh, we deliver it to the customer. There are different positions as well as RF engineer in our uh, service delivery department, like uh, drive test, people that go directly on the field. Personally, I went in the last seven months uh, in, for instance to Red um, Bull Arena in Leipzig where I had to check with the walk test the coverage of the 5G cells inside the stadium but there are as well roles like um, what I'm currently doing for uh, um, collection of data, network optimization for the detection, preparation of uh, reports using a lot of uh, let's say software like sex cells or uh, specific Huawei tools for measurements and then as well uh, principal RF engineers position that they are self for leaders, for people that have more experience, that they can show to other younger engineers like me, graduate after university, how and uh, what to do in uh, for uh, the different project with the customer, and as well, let's say, more managerial position, project management, or like uh, more line manager, let's say, position. Everything is possible, and uh, I would say as well that in the next uh, years, I hope uh, to uh, build, of course, uh, to further build my career here, and. Uh, maybe in a few years as well after I get to know more about uh, RF uh, field maybe move to more project management position and deal mainly with the customer rather than with the parameters itself anyway everything is um, up to you guys and uh, I will say to you all the best and uh, thank you for your attention